My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. We got a really unique 1971 Plymouth Satellite Sport sitting right here. It's an exceptionally clean car, high performance 360 motor in it, $50,000 in receipts, documentation going back to day one. I tell you, typically I read every piece of paper on every car that comes in. I don't have a whole weekend to read this one, so whoever buys the car, uh, if they care to, will be able to go through this uh, paperwork one page at a time. But it's got documentation going back to when it was new, receipts for all the work that was done. Um, but what I can do is I can summarize for you what is in here uh, based on what the owner gave me a, a summary letter. So anyway, it's a 71 Plymouth. Really cool car. Can't wait to tell you all about it. If you go to volocars.com, you can also read all the specs, study all the pictures, and get the price. Not only on this one, but we do have a few hundred collector cars all for sale. If you just enjoy watching the videos, you can subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on the bell icon, and you'll be notified as the new ones are posted. For right now, why don't you join me? Let's go for a spin. Very clean car to begin with. It's a 78,000 mile car. I believe the door jams, engine bay, and trunk are still the original paint, and it's super clean. Underneath the car is really clean metal. Uh, I'm going to say I think this is an uncut original metal body. <clears throat> the floors, I don't see any patches. They're all nice and clean. They were repainted and made to look nice. You look up at the motor, the bottom of the motor is spotless. It has some really wild headers. They're really squirrely and twisted, and they're all uh, wrapped with heat tape uh, to keep the heat away from the motor and the starter. Flowmaster exhaust system. Uh, it's got a little crossover pipe, has stainless tips, stainless clamps. Uh, it has an eight and three quarter rear end with 355 uh, locker gears in the back. The drive shaft was rebuilt and balanced. It has a TCI 727 Torque Flight automatic transmission with all sorts of work done to it. Uh, 2200 stall, custom aluminum welded oil pan, has an external oil cooler. Uh, brakes up front are Willwood disc brakes. The rear brakes are drum. They're rebuilt. The front end was rebuilt. has upper uh, tubular control arms. Uh, it has Edelbrock gas shocks all the way around. The rear leaf springs have been replaced. Uh, it has a new fuel tank and fuel system. So underneath of the car is really well sorted, rock solid metal. You don't have to worry about rust. And everything looks to be in great uh, mechanical condition as well. The body's outstanding. You look down both sides, there's no waves, no dents, no rust bubbles. It is absolutely straight everywhere. I'm looking across the hood, it's laser straight. This hood gap is precise. It's flush and it's square. Same with the doors. I purposely left the windows rolled up because they're crystal clear and they fit spot on. It has chrome sport mirrors. The door handle looks like it's re-chromed. This is just mint. It even feels slick. No bubbles. It's got Roadrunner stickers on it here. Black vinyl top. This trim is polished. It's all in beautiful shape. The rear window is crystal clear. The trunk fits perfectly square and flush. No bubbles, no issues, no cracking. The metal flakes laid out. The clear coat is glossy. The rear bumper has been re-chromed. Tail lights look mint. Same thing on this side, it's all smooth, nice clean metal, no bubbles. Does have the turn signals on the fenders, they worked. I tried it as I was pulling the car in. It's all just as nice as the other side. Doors open and shut real nice on this car. It's got some nice looking wheels with BF Goodrich tires. Car sits nice, tires are a little fatter in back, it's got a nice stance. Has this, uh, you know, I don't know if you want to call it a scooped hood or whatever, but nice design on the hood with some nice hood pins. The front bumper is re-chromed. 
Look at the pictures on our website. The little roadrunner has bloodshot eyes and a cigarette hanging out of its beak. <laughs> thought that was cool. And the motor. Performance-built 360 motor. It's got Edelbrock aluminum heads, a polished intake, a polished 600 uh, Edelbrock carburetor. It has a thumper cam, so it's got a nice lopity sound. Uh, with a cam like that, you lose vacuum. So they have a polished vacuum pump with a reserve reservoir, all polished components. It's got cold air conditioning, power steering, power brakes. The jams are mint, and I think this is the original paint in the jams. The rubber, the sill plates are excellent. That door shuts just as nice as the other side. The interior is all redone. Guys added something that you'll like, power trunk. Trunk compartment, uh, it does have Dynamant on the floor, sound deadener, but it's the original paint in here and it's excellent. The metal is spotless, full size spare, has the jack. The battery has been relocated to the trunk. It's in a nice uh, battery box and it has a big master disconnect switch. Trunk is in really nice shape, has LED trunk light. It still has the original VIN number sticker here in the door jam. It's a legendary interior, so the upholstery, bright blue seats and carpet, beautiful. The seats are comfortable. The instrument panel, the lenses, the chrome bezels, the heater controls, uh, the tough grip steering wheel, all of that is mint. Getting back in the motor, all the components have been redone. It's got a Wizard Racing cooling system, big polished aluminum radiator with twin electric fans, has these nice braided wraps over all the hoses with billet clamps, polished overflow bottle, has a polished high flow aluminum uh, water pump, uh, it has an, a modern alternator, modern air conditioning system, all the brackets and pulleys, everything is new. It has uh, some sort of billet ignition system, uh, flamethrower coil, it has a Roadrunner horn. We'll check that out in a minute. And the metal, clean original metal, original paint, no signs of damage or rust. And the VIN number on the core support and the cowl match the car. The headliner, visors, all that's mint. The interior lights are all blue. Door panels are real nice. All the plastic trim is really nice. There is a tachometer on top of the dash and it has this carpet overlay. I did reach my hand under there. I did feel there is a crack in the dash pad. But when you're sitting in here looking at everything, the vents, the wood grain, the glove box door, it's mint. It has a B&M shifter on the floor, a ratchet shifter. It has its original seat belts in real nice shape. The seat feels so good. Electric fuel pump. Yeah, hear that boogity 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 sound? That's that thumper cam. It's got roller rockers. That's that's a good running motor right there. Snappy. Tinted glass. is exceptional it's just it's really clean throughout it's got great sounding great running motor it's it's just different from all the cars out there you won't park next to another car just like this one and it comes with all that documentation just a good good quality car i think it's been a quality car all of its life and someone just kept making it better and better and better that's my impression of this car you can go to volocars.com plenty of ways to contact the salespeople. They are more than happy to answer any specific concerns, questions you have. They can also make financing, delivery, paperwork real easy for you. 
find them at volocars.com. If you enjoy watching our videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on that bell icon, and you'll be the first to see the next one posted. Thanks for watching.